Hello and welcome to the second installment of King of the Banlist. I'm your host Jacola, and in this show I will compare the finite amount of balance prediction videos of the actual banlist posted by Konami and determine who is the best predicting the changes can sit at the banlist throne and become the king of the ban list. There are of course some rules to this, so let's get through those real quick. For every correctly predicted change in the ban list, the prediction gets plus two points. For every correctly predicted card but not its change on the list, the prediction gets plus one point. For every predicted card which was not changed on the list, the prediction gets minus one point. For every card which was not predicted but was changed on the list, the prediction gets minus two points. To facilitate the various sizes of each prediction, I decided to do some additional math. Some of the points will be applied per card on the prediction and then multiplied by the number of the new cards on the March 2021 ban list. With this, the total score of the prediction will be applied as if the prediction had the same amount of cards as the actual ban list. With the rules somewhat clearly stated, let's go over the <coughs> willing candidates for the title of the king of the ban list in alphabetical order. Now that the prediction has been shown, I'll give the stage to Jacobo from the past so he can react to the ban list live. Right back at you, buddy. Hello everyone, Jacobo from the past here. So yeah, the ban list just dropped, and uh, that is a thing, just like, well, my future self mentioned in the video. So I haven't seen it yet, I know nothing about it, so uh, let's get on with this. Effective from okay, that that there is a thing that will uh, be seen. Effective from March fifteenth. Please note the change to Firewall Dragon from from Britain to Unlimited does not take effect until April fourteenth. Oh my God, Firewalls Dragons Unlimited. <laughs> nice. The next update will be no earlier than July. Okay, so what do we get in here? 
the strudel still banned steam cyber jar wait wait a minute <laughs> I don't see a face here, which I'm very happy about. <laughs> okay, Maxi is still banned. This is good. This is good. <laughs> I don't see Dragon Buster Destruction Sword over here. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Dragon Buster! A zero and. Holy shit, a zero and. VFT. I don't think I have seen anyone talking about Union Carrier getting banned. So, um, yeah, that is a thing. I haven't seen that ban in any prediction, so that is a big hit. Oh my god, yes! <laughs> oh, yes. Turn top still at three. Is that one? <laughs> then the next one. Oh god, yeah. That, that was pretty much what everyone was expecting, so nothing to do here. Wait. Let me check one more thing. Uh, gentry heavy star. Evil choice. Okay, but fusion is still banned. Okay, what we've got next? Slash draw. Hornet drones, multi eye roll. Okay, nothing got limited except Benton. Okay, what about semis? Only malicious. Oh my god, so. The unlimited is going to be crazy! <laughs> Bardish, the Lauren, Ignister, Prominence, True King's Return. Okay, so I've seen people talking about Firewall Dragon, Rusty Bardish, and True King's Return. Those three were pretty much in most of the in most of the predictions no one predicted buster buster dragon getting unlimited nida was the lauren ignister promise i haven't seen anyone talk about argent chaos force so yeah i am i am very happy buster my buster blader is at full force again oh yes yes <laughs> So, yeah, that will be it for this segment, and back to you, Jekyll. Thank you, Jekyll, from the past. So, just so we're clear, the balance looks like this. Before we get to the result, I decided to gift some additional prizes, aka bragging rights, to some contestants that excelled in various categories. The winner in this category is the person who protected the most cards right. Please note that winning in this category doesn't equal winning the right to sit on the balance throne. Also, I'm counting the number of predicted cards disregarding their placement on the list. If a card was mentioned, then it counts. Most people predicted 3 or 4 cards, with some predicting 5 or 6 in total. However, only one person correctly predicted 6 cards and their placement on the list. That's why the winner of the most cards predicted category is... Mage Power! Congratulations, my dude, and I hope your future predictions will be even better. This category is interesting since it somewhat correlates with how big the prediction was. With more cards predicted, there's a higher chance of making a wrong call. For the sake of brevity, I will be counting every card correctly predicted, but with a different placement on the list as a right call. That's why the winner of this category with 22 wrong calls is... Create 9 TCG. I'll help you do better next time, buddy. We're finally here, the moment everyone has been waiting for. Who is going to be the king or queen of the ban list and have the right to sin on the ban list throne. At least for the next 
three months. To build up the suspense and dramatic tension, I'll start with the person that came third and grant them the title of the Bandless Vizier. That person with minus 5.87 points is no other than a somewhat known German Twitch streamer Yugi Tuber, who's also shiny hiding in her free time. Herzliche Glückwünsche, Annie Evie. Now for the person that came in second and is going to be branded the Grand Bandlist Vizier. As much as it repulsed me to say it, I have actually never hidden the fact that I dislike the guy, but the data doesn't lie and I have to accept it. No matter what my feelings about the matter are, I want to be as objective as humanly possible. Therefore, without further ado, with minus 5.08 points, the pant god himself. Terrific gaming. Congratulations. With the royal court completed, who is going to rule? Who will sit on the Banless throne for the next three months? The person who won this iteration of Killing the Banless is a YouTuber from a small unknown country I've never heard about. Like, seriously, where's Mexico? Rocking 10,000 subs, a very interesting YouTube icon, and a minus 2.44 points in this entire show. I give you crazy monkey cards. All Hail the king, and let his reign be long and prosperous. And now that we're done with this, I would like to congratulate our winners, especially our new king. Since all entries were <coughs> willing, I'd like to thank everyone for participating. Links to our channels will be in the pinned comments, since it's too many characters to put in the description. And with that out of the way, I bid you all goodbye. Jacobo's hanging out. Pace?